A 51-year-old woman was referred to our hospital for blackouts and worsening breathlessness. On assessment, she was in New York Heart Association, class 4, and had marked peripheral edema. Her medical history included systemic lupus erythematosus, for which she was treated with azathioprine, prednisolone and hydroxychloroquine, which she'd been taking for the past 19 years. She had undergone a gastric banding operation 14 months previously, and her body mass index had reduced from 46 kilograms per metre squared to 25. On examination, the jugular venous pressure was elevated. She had bilateral peripheral edema and abdominal distension. An electrocardiogram showed sinus rhythm with right bundle branch block and evidence of right ventricular hypertrophy. High sensitivity to troponin and N-terminal pro-B type natriuretic peptide were elevated and renal function was impaired. A transthoracic echocardiogram showed left ventricular hypertrophy, a small left ventricular cavity and impaired longitudinal function, but normal ejection fraction. Both atria were dilated and the right ventricle was impaired. Cardiac MRI scanning confirmed left ventricular hypertrophy with extensive late gadolinium enhancement in the mid wall of the ventricle in a non-coronary pattern. We suspected hydroxychloroquine as the cause and stopped this medication. Right ventricular biopsy showed marked vacuolation and electron microscopy demonstrated lamella bodies and lysosomes filled with phospholipid rich material as shown in the lower power slide and curvilinear bodies as seen in the higher power slide. The differential diagnosis of Fabry disease was excluded with gene testing and she improved over the most next 12 months with reduction in NYHA class and NT-proBNP. We believe that the rapid weight loss uh, after ga uh, gastric banding accelerated pre-existing hydroxychloroquine cardiomyopathy and the diagnosis should be considered to, in patients on long-term hydroxychloroquine with evidence of restricted cardiomyopathy as it may be partially reversible on stopping the medication.